Look at me a little closer. No! TV is just such a weird place. We have those weird children cartoon shows about like talking fruits. We have weird teenage drama shows. We also have soap operas. But among the genre of TV shows, we have game shows. In this video, I want to expose a game show host named Fergie Over. I was almost going to call you Lori. How could I miss? Oh, it's very easy. You're both very pretty. Thank you have green eyes. Blue. Are they? They're not blue. Now, don't tell me that. Look at me a little closer. They're green. Wow! Good old Fergie, you know, open up the show with just awkwardness. <laughs> oh my god! Fergie! What is wrong with you, dude? She is not having it at all. Talk about getting married and having a family and things like that. <laughs> no. You don't? What What do you do uh, when you're 11 years old for a date? Where do you go? What, what, what are some things you do? We just walk home from school with each other. Oh, you walk home from school with each other. <laughs> well, can't walk you home from school because uh, I graduated 30 years ago. Jesus Christ, like he has no filter. He's just really doing this. I can only imagine what the guy behind the camera's face looks like as he's literally watching this happen. Look at me a little closer. They're green. <laughs> that cool look like a young lady who likes to give lots of hugs and kisses out, do you? <laughs> eh? Not really. Not Bitch! <laughs> Why are you mad? Not really. That is so awkward. Not really. Can I have a hug and a kiss? I can't have one? Mm -mm. Even if I say and whisper in your ear that, Allison, you're gonna win the show, I still uh -uh. can't have a hug and a kiss? Uh-uh. Well, I guess you can't win the show then. If I don't get a hug and a kiss. What kind of person says that to a child? Like, if you win, you, you gonna win. If you give me a... You, Allison, pucker up if you want to win this show, because if not, looks like you're catching a fat L. This guy looks like freaking the real life version of Toad from Mario Kart. Like, what is, why? Allison is just trying to win the game fair and square, and Fergie over here is just trying to throw a bunch of different curveballs at her. Dirty old man. Yeah, you hear that? <laughs> Dirty old man, someone just said. Like, honestly, yes. Like, someone please get up and smack Toad up top of his mushroom looking head and put him in his place. <laughs> no kisses? No way, this man just tried to pull a fast one, but she's got reaction time. She did a whole dodging kisses and stuff, clapping up for Tracy. Are you shy? A bit. Can I have a little kiss, please? Oh. <laughs> no way this perv just made that noise. That is disgusting. <laughs> you give out kisses though, don't you, Stephanie? No. Oh, you don't too? You call her Stephanie? I call her Me Too Movement. Stephanie, come on. Just give me a little, a little, for the one time. You know, Fergie, I have a slight hunch that maybe she's not gonna, you know, lay a fat one on you because, uh, she don't know you. You're a creep, you're a perv, you're scaring her. Okay, we've got Stephanie and Lorraine here in the big family kiss. I couldn't get that kiss earlier. <laughs> this girl's mom, just to shut this old perv up, lays a fat, wet, juicy kiss on his cheek. I just did a Google search on Fergie Olver and literally all the information that I could ever want has popped up on him. He was a game show host in the 1980s, he got married in the 1980s, and he has three kids. That's insane to me. What I can see from this Wikipedia too is actually that his wife that he was co-hosting the show with isn't the same as his current wife. The wife he was co-hosting the show with was named Catherine Swing and his current wife's name is Susan Wheeler. 
I don't know how long the show went on personally, but what I do see here is that he got married, like remarried in 1986. So if this show was still going on in 1986, which I would guess it was if the show was going on all throughout the 1980s, that maybe they got divorced in the middle of the show. I don't, I don't really know. Maybe this Susan Wheeler woman is just marrying him because of his money. I don't know how much money he could have made from the show, but people clout chase, I guess. But that's gonna be it, guys. Thank you so much for watching this video. It means the world to me. If you did enjoy this video, don't forget to drop a like, comment down below if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, and subscribe if you're new. But like I said before, guys, thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to watch my content. It means the world to me, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Adios, muchachos. Bang.